the bee movie about bees from 2007 animated is one which uses some really bizarre contradictions one after another throws them at the viewer so fast that one can't process them and one way it does this is with the bee energy policy the companies that Barry Benson takes to court as part of his lawsuit are involved in energy production as well the puns involving honey have to do with Hunron and Honeyburton Halliburton is an oil field services company it helps in oil production and Enron is an energy marketing company so honey is presented in this way and the bees are shown with honey used as a substitute for gasoline among other things so they're driving around in honey propelled cars and one bee drinks out of the gas tank at one point this is an extremely wasteful way to go about doing your business because it takes such an enormous amount of effort for them an enormous number of flight miles and the labor involved in stirring and churning and eating and regurgitating and all the rest in order to make this honey and then just put it in your gas tank to drive across the hive is, it seems like a horrible waste especially when you consider what appear to be the hidden messages in the film with regard to energy one being that bees fly f without regard for our known laws of physics so there's this sense that bees already presented as a secret society at the beginning of the film have access to some sort of knowledge that humans don't or at least the humans that were openly told about in the film this gets particularly strange when one of the visual puns one of the many visual puns of the movie comes up toward the end the bees are brought in to land an airplane <laughs> this would take an enormous amount of lift something you shouldn't be able to do on just sugar power and the bees managed nevertheless but in doing so they assume the shape of a flying vehicle that's not in official well some semi-official now recognition some people say this thing actually exists or they've seen plans for it or people have talked about it and so on and this is a triangular shaped flying craft which in, can hover like a flying saucer when it's a flat triangle shape and this is the shape that the bees take up when they go to land the plane they assume the shape of multiple flat flying triangles so on the one hand they're driving around in what would be for them extremely primitive gas-powered internal combustion well honey-powered internal combustion engines and on the other hand they can land a plane under their own power so why in the world are they not using this sort of technology in their daily lives um or for other than just flight they could lift anything with it presumably or they can lift a jumbo jet and the name of this craft is one of the b puns because it's triangular tr so then, and when the plane is landed it is landed by these triangles made up of bees the name of the flying craft being the tr3b so when the plane is landed it is landed by tr3bs